Hey there. Well, it's not quite March. Tomorrow is the 1st of March, but I am down here in South Tampa. I had an errand to run. So I am at Trader Joe's again, even though it is not technically March. This is going to be a mini March haul. Um, so I'm going to get some snacks for tonight because I'm having Mahjong. There's Trader Joe's sign in the background somewhere back there. And um, my goal today is to try to keep the total of my haul to $50 or less. So let's go and see if I can do that. Okay, so it looks like I still managed to get three bags like I always do, but I only spent 55 this time. Let's go home and see what I got. Okay, so we're back from the store. I didn't stay at my 50. I actually went 55, so I went five above. So it was $5 more than I wanted to spend, but I did not buy any wine this time. Usually I buy the almond flavor biscotti type of um, sparkling wine. I still have a bottle of it left. I have the girls coming over tonight, which is why I decided to stop by there because I wanted some snacky stuff for tonight. And I still have stuff left over from last time, so I wanted to keep the price kind of low. So I thought I did well for $55. It is three bags, but one of the bags is super light. So let's see what I got. All right, first of all, I got more of the cauliflower stir fry rice. I tried this last week and it's very good. If you've not tried it yet, I highly recommend it. And it tastes like you're eating stir fry rice, but you're eating cauliflower. I love the Indian stuff, so I decided to try this. I've never had this before. This is called Palak Paneer. It's got curry and chili, but there's no rice in it. It's just got um, spinach and cheese and curry. So I thought I would try that. Hana Masala. I always get this when I can, when I'm out, because I love this stuff. This actually lasts me two meals. My husband does not like it, so I'll split it in half and have half and then have the other half. I finally found everything but the bagel. I've heard so much about this. So I'm going to have to try to make some more of those bagels and try this on it. Um, this will probably go on some other good things to bake with. So I'm going to uh, maybe use this to season up hamburgers or chopped meat. So I'm excited to have this and try it. I got my standby black bean dip. We get this almost every time we go. I got for tonight pub cheese. Last time I accidentally bought the horseradish and boy, it was strong. So this time I just got the regular pub cheese. I got a uh, tomato basil. I was really hoping for red pepper hummus. They didn't have it. So I got the tomato basil for tonight. I already have still some of the organic leftover from last time. I'll put that out tonight as well. Okay, so I decided I've been seeing um, you know how I did that dough recipe for the bagels with the flour and the Greek yogurt? You can see that up here. Well, I know that you can use the dough for a lot of different things. One of the things I thought I would try was to try to make cinnamon rolls, but using that dough recipe because it's only three points on Weight Watchers. Again, I'm not on Weight Watchers, but I know that for people that are using it, and I just try to stay low on the carbs. But I thought, hmm, I wonder how it would taste if you used vanilla Greek yogurt. And so I didn't get a big one of it. I also couldn't find a small regular Greek yogurt. But I thought, hey, I wonder how it tastes if you put the vanilla in it. Give it some vanilla flavor because you're going to be putting cinnamon in it. So it could be good. So I'm gonna, it's going to be an experiment that we're going to try. So I got two of these. I only need eight ounces, and each one of these is... Uh, 5.3 ounces, so 
I'll only be uh, using eight ounces of it and the rest will just eat on the side. This is new to try for either a lunch or a dinner. This is scallops with mushrooms. I hate mushrooms, but my husband would like this. He really liked the chili Rolano that I got him last time. So he asked me to get some more. So I got him two boxes of this. For tonight, I got spinach artichoke dip. Can't go wrong with that. I got some baby carrots. I've never really buy their produce there. I usually go sprouts for produce, but um, I want vegetables out this time because I I'm trying to not eat the potato chips and the tortilla chips right now. So carrots should be fine. I'm also gonna cut up some celery and then I'm gonna have some ranch dressing and the hummus on the side and it goes really good with the vegetables. Also for my husband to try, I decided uh, to try the shrimp soft tacos for lunch. Since he liked the chili Rolanos this time, we'll try this one now next. My lunch, a barbecue chicken salad. Got more of the drumettes which are super easy to make. They're already pre-cooked and the hubby likes them. Bag two. All right, last bag, which is the lightest bag of them all. This is the snacky stuff for tonight. So of course I always get the organic tortilla chips. They're great, they're not expensive, and I like the fact that they're organic. My husband loves potato chips. These are less than wise and bigger than wise. I think they're really good. So I have a bag of those. And then for tonight, for people who don't wanna have vegetables, I got some potato chips to go along with the, the hummus that I'm gonna be putting out. So that's it, that's my haul, short and sweet, $55 and change. My plan was not to go back to Trader Joe's right away, but because I was down there to pick up my watch, I thought, and I was having guests over tonight, I figured why not go down there and pick up some stuff. So I picked up stuff that I know we'll eat and for tonight's uh, Mahjong game, I'm teaching some girls how to play tonight, so that'll be fun. Well, thank you for tuning into the wonderful world of Wendy. Don't forget to subscribe below. Give me that thumbs up, and I'll see you next time. Bye.